Hello, my name's Jack O'Dell, and I'm composer and co-designer on Poncho, and I'm going to show you the basic mechanics of the game, and tease a little bit of one of the early areas. So here's our protagonist, a little blue robot that wakes up in an overgrown world. It wakes up wearing a large red garment, a curious link to the past, and so, with little else significant about it, the local inhabitants call it Poncho. In Poncho, we play around with the idea of interacting with parallax layers. What this means is that the world is split into three different layers, a foreground, middle ground and background layer, and this little robot can shift between them at any time. This gives us a whole lot of depth to an otherwise two-dimensional world, and it allows us to create a lot of interesting environments to explore. Let me show you how this works. So we have the option to shift in two directions, forward and backward. If I were to shift forward from here, I'll end up in the foreground layer. Here, I can only interact and move along this layer. If I was to go back and shift to the back layer, you can see that we now have access to this area. And I can go over to the store or see what's happening over here on the right. As you can see, as you go behind things, the layers will go transparent, showing you hidden areas that you might not have known were there before. And that's one of the most exciting things about Poncho. We're creating a world to be explored, where hidden treasures and secret pathways lead you meandering through a world filled with troubled history and colourful inhabitants. So that's a quick overview of the basic mechanics of the game. Thanks for watching.